Okay, guys, so, um, kind of get back to what I was saying is that come right now, I'm trying to figure out what to do from now on because I was right in the middle of doing a little series of reviewing some of my dolls, but seeing that YouTube's changing their rules and all these, and all these things going on right now, and I don't feel comfortable making doll videos anymore because I just don't know, so... So, as you're seeing this, I'm doing more over over 13 plus older audience content that's like showing my feeding tube more, talking about chronic illness more, openly because I read on YouTube um, their guidelines for their new kids for, for not for kids and for kids button. Selection that medical videos are not made for kids, technically, but so I'm showing my feeding tube more and talking about being more open about my chronic illness. You're gonna see a, a big change in my channel starting now up into the new year because, like, more coupon videos, more chronic illness videos, or things like that. Because more videos like that, I might. If YouTube figures out about the middle ground, they might address that. I highly doubt they're going to address the middle ground. I wish they did. Some people are talking about it. Some people aren't. Um, but this has been going on in my mind for a while. I will talk to you guys about it. But starting now, um, obviously, people say swear in your videos. Like, I'm not going to swear. I don't swear. Some people are saying swear in your videos. That ain't going to help you. Because then you're going to get demonetized if you do make videos to where you, if you are monetized. So, swearing ain't going to help. <laughs> so, anyways, that being said, I want so many videos pertaining to the new YouTube rules starting this new YouTube terms of service and also the YouTube rules starting in January 2020. Which is really... Aggravating because it's not only really aggravating, but again, doll collectors, American Girl dolls. What's the one thing we look forward to? And the one thing we film about doll release, the doll of the year for that following year release. I don't know if that'll be allowed or not. I mean, obviously, I I watch videos about that, like talking about the new doll of the year. I watch. Little preview videos, little snippet videos, um, like Good Morning America every year. The last couple of years, they have showed a preview of Doll of the Year. They showed Doll of the Year preview on Good Morning America on December 31st. See what the doll looks like. And so far, right now, I haven't seen any preview pictures of the doll. Which is actually pretty good because it, it, it's. But anyways, but aside from that, they're doing it because obviously safety and stuff. But they're doing it to because trust me, January first, the whole day I'm online. I watch Doll of the Year of the new the new Doll of the Year video. But trust me, I do. I know everyone in the doll community does too. Watch this doll videos on the AG2 platform. So, so yeah, like, I, that's one thing I look forward to, like, every January, I always go online and look at the doll, the new doll of the year, so, that's really cool to, I always look at it to see, like, I'm an, I have a doll collector, I've been a doll collector of American Girl forever, but, um, anyway, so, back to what I was saying is that, I'm kind of slowly implementing changes into my channel now, because I just don't know I just don't know what's going to happen between now and the end, and the start of the new year. And, so right now I'm kind of switching up my, my, my YouTube a little bit more. Also doing blogging, where again I'm showing my feed to you, but I'm kind of running around in circles at this point, but, I, I promise. But, um, I'm blogging more in a way... That 
isn't as entertaining to a child. That's not as interesting. It's like grown-ups, like this person's talking about YouTube and coupons. It's over, it's over their head. So, like obviously someone that's older than a kid would be interested in it. Like coupons, however old the person is that likes the coupon. But anyway, so... I'm now starting the changing, I mean, I, I started slowly kind of figuring out some things on my YouTube channel. I'm changing some things now, before the new year, because I don't know. I mean, I'm not a partner, I just feel that now's the time to kind of change up my platform. Change up my videos and doing more more couponing videos whenever I can, and also finish up my series of couponing with a dispel. I never finished that one because I was really, really fatigued, but I have more videos coming up for that one. Um, so there's that. I'll be doing, um, again, album reviews or music reviews, like, for example, Five Fear Death Punch and Disturb, like, they swear in their songs, so I do reaction videos on occasion to their music, and that being, again, they have a big fan base as well, and same with Hunter, and our people, so, other celebrities and stuff, how will that work? But I kind of, I'm kind of playing it, kind of changing up my content, because I know, because I just don't know when I want to, and I want to, um, See the comments and everyone. I want to see everybody's. Like, I want people to comment on my videos and I want thumbs up and like and whatever not. Because doing more. Again, doing things that aren't like boring to a child. Like, things that are boring, like blogging. I don't know. And then with blogging in general, I'm. Not a big blogger, so it just varies. I, I'm not a big family blogger either, so I'm highly against family blogging. I never show my siblings other than, like, probably my dad on occasion, but I'm not a big implementing on family blogging. I'm highly against it. I just don't like the idea of family blogging and just family. I mean, I, I, I've seen people that do family channels, and some of them I've seen... But yeah, I'm, I'm not a big family, I'm, I'm not a family blogger, um, I don't make videos with my, but I was just already more, you know, when they were little, they like, they were little, but now I'm being more cautious and wary of that now. But um, yeah, so, you're only gonna see me on my blog, for blog, but see my on occasion, maybe see, see maybe my dad or mom in the background. But I'm not gonna show my siblings or any of my siblings because some of them are like my. So I'm I'm really cautious about what I say and do on YouTube in general. So I'm just gonna sh say it say it now. I'm only like two days into Blogmas that you're only gonna see me on my YouTube channel. Just me on Blogmas and no one else. You might see my mom and dad in the background, but that's it. But i rather do it that way and play it safe. I'm not going to, like, in years past, I've never showed my family. You might hear their voices in the background or TV in the background, but that's all you're going to get. Like, like when we cut down on Christmas, you're going to hear my, my siblings' voices in the background. So, you're not going to see their faces. I'm, I'm just being honest. I'm not a big, I'm not, I'm not one to do that. I'm, I'm against it. I've seen, I'm just seen on just reality shows of what it can do to a family. I, I've watched many reality shows and see what it can do to people, and I see what being a blogger can do to people on occasion. I, I, I see, even on YouTube in general, I see many sides of YouTube, and I am, I don't want to cross that line. I know that line. I know where I stand on things with YouTube, like, there's videos you're you're not gonna see from me. You're not gonna see videos of me showing my entire family. I'm not doing that. I'm not ever gonna say my last name. I'm not gonna do that either. 
for the safety of my family, for my brothers and sisters and my parents. I'm not going to do that. Like I said yesterday, I'm not going to show my, show my one. So, yeah, so. So. I'm very cautious because of that. I'm always wary, and which is why I'm, I'm, I'm saying this now. Um, but, again, I'm, from now on, here on out, I'm changing up the way my content is to appeal to a older audience, like, more coupon, more chronic illness things, unless, unless YouTube, eventually, some people are saying, like, oh, eventually YouTube will, will figure that one out, but, figure out the general audiences, but what I've heard people saying is, I, I don't know, so I'm, right now I'm just switching up my content to appeal to older people to older peers, so, yeah, so I'm gonna talk to you guys a little bit later, um, uh, later on tonight, so, yeah, just a little bit of my thoughts of YouTube and my, and my thoughts about blogging and stuff, so, yeah, I'm gonna get some more coffee and watch some TV.